What if the Joker kills Batman? Joker was finally able to kill Batman. The story picks up three days later, with Lois Lane doing an interview with Alfred in the Bat Cave over the death of the hero. Alfred has revealed his true identity to the world, so that the public may honor and remember Bruce as the hero he really was. Then they conduct a massive funeral is held for Batman, with almost all of Gotham attending the massive tribute. Joker also came to that funeral. He secretly brought a suicide vest to the event as one last joke to pull on his old enemy. But to his shock, he doesn't find a heartbroken and disheartened crowd. Instead, he finds people smiling and laughing at his memory, inspired by his actions. Everyone decides to do what Batman did, and turn tragedy into a chance to be better. Having lost his nemesis, Joker no longer has a true purpose in life. The only audience he ever cared about impressing is gone forever, and Joker becomes the only one in the crowd who isn't smiling. Joker ends up leaving the crowd without using the vest. Later he started working for the Gotham Department of Motor Vehicles.